I'm back. <laughs> Just went out for a dog walk with Louise and um, and I was contemplating on the last video that I just did and <clears throat> some more information come through so I just wanted to share that before I forget it because what happens is sometimes is that the remembrance fades um, and a deeper understanding needs to come forward before that can be integrated so I really wanted to get this out on camera so that I can remember it um, because amnesia sort of kicks in for me quite a lot and um, and I just hope that that this uh, resonates with you okay so the last video that I did was about the anarchy which I know how to spell it now um, it's got an A A N U, not A N N now yeah, well um, and the fallen angels and the mythology behind that is that there were seem to be the bad guys um, there are different pathways within this information that was given that was one perspective my guides are telling me so one perspective was that actually this they did come down to earth and they integrated and this is what I wanted to talk about which is the next understanding a layer of information for you um, and I just hope that this sort of sits with you because if it does then it's it's um, assisting you into your remembrance of who you are and where you came from so okay so there we have the earth okay and we came down into planetary on our spaceship and there's the um bunnies okay coming down onto earth now here we've got humanity we've got humanity is already there a primitive uh, um force of energy of beingness of consciousness um uh, 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 it's just within their state they are there um, on the earth we come in and then as we start to um uh, disperse across the whole of the world we start to integrate and coupling in the process of intermingling with the species okay so we have a human and a star being a star source of beingness okay and then with that then you get um, a hybrid of 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 DNA You know what I'm saying. So you get a hybrid of DNA coming through. Now with that, throughout all the time, the linear time span, as time goes on, the DNA structure starts to change. It starts to change, it starts to morph. But it also, it holds a resonance of density And it's all ancestral. It's all ancestral density that's held in the DNA structure and this deep cellular structure of the form. So the flow comes in in an incarnation, comes in, comes back in again, but it holds a, uh, a form, a, a DNA structure within the deep cellular structure because there is a coupling in a physical form. So a physical form and a physical form come together. So whether it's a star being and humanity, uh, a, uh, an, uh, an individual of the, the soul that was already here in that conscious state, as the higher forces come in and intermingle and create a hybrid, there is a DNA um, change within the structure of the humanity. And the evolution of humanity's status of, was staged at that point. And that's where the um, creation of the physical form and the star being status connected. And with that, it holds that within our physical self. So not only are we this, we are also human, the new form of human. Because we intermingled here, we intermingled with humanity. So we are humanity. 
but our origin at a soul level comes from a higher force of integration a higher level consciousness and with that we have an evolved soul connection so a, hum a, a pure human the very few pure humans um, if at all but the integration and the migration of the vibration to vibration of the annies and the annies when they coupled you have more of a purebred but intermingled with humanity along the way yes so the ancestral line is important here the ancestral line the origin of the soul is coming from a high resonance of frequency of connection to consciousness at a higher level of um, understanding but humanity in its purest form did not it's like um it is it's, it's like a rock and a and a and a bear it, they are two different layers of consciousness it doesn't mean say one's better than the other it's just a different layer of understanding and remembrance of consciousness and remember we are all coming from the same source so it's not to see the last video in separation it is about the deep remembrance of the soul that creates the understanding at a deep level to enable you to then start to remember that you are a sovereign being of light and your story your origin and the remembrance then activates the DNA structure to a higher level of high um, high light quotients to be received to increase it again to enable you to start connecting to your sovereignty to your multidimensionality to your oversoul which is coming back which is the ascension process so I really wanted to do this video on this is to know that not to feel sorry for yourself but it is about the healing process of those deep core wounds Now the deep core wounds within your energetic field at a deep cellular structure is coming right from this situation that went up here with the galactic war if you at a deep soul connective um, emotional state um, when you're in a high resonant state to dip down into such deep despair and you're descending down into earth then the deep core wound comes from a galactic source so there are layers of healing there is a layer of healing within the emotional state within the incarnate that is there residing as a, a separation in form and there's also the galactic core wound that comes right back to source of origin so when we're looking at deep core wounds it might be that it, it's it's actually showing itself um in a childhood trauma it might be showing it that it's holding it um, with an emotional state of a repetition of relationship issues. The deep core wound is that of is a realization of grief and separation. You're separated from your origin. And it creates sadness. It creates fear. <laughs> and it creates anger. Do you get it? I hope you do. I hope this is getting through to you. So I really want to come on and speak about that. I'm going to put it up on the same day. So two videos, bonus, bonus for uh, for the 1st of February. All this information came through. I'm going to do another video actually um, to separate it um, with the planetary systems. It's all starting to come in. So I'm going to do another video on that. Probably post that one for tomorrow for you. 
Um, so yeah, I'll be wearing the same clothes. <laughs> it's all done in the same day. Um, so yeah, so just to, to understand that absolutely we're not in separation to humanity. Our sole origin of the is of the anarchy, the, the said fallen angels. There is a different pathway within that. But you may resonate with that storyline, that um, remembrance of who you are. But there are also different perspectives upon that experience. I've just only told you one. But there are other experiences from different places of separation and perspectives. And it's about going in and just looking at your core wounds, seeing where it actually comes from. And it goes far deeper than in this incarnation. Deep, deep, deep cellular stru- stuff here. You've got to go quantum when you're coming to healing. Okay. Take care, everyone. Hope everybody's okay. Um, check out all my details below. If you want to contact me, um, I, I do all of this sort of work. It's just big, big, deep realizations of um, interconnectivity with multidimensionality all time and space it all interlinks and that i'm sort of starting to unpack it all i've not read anything of this up i'm just getting this downloaded to me so i hope this um uh sparks your understanding to a little bit deeper level um and uh see it from your perspective okay take care everyone see you soon bye